Well, the breaking news from this morning in the Oakland area, the family, a family losing their eight year old daughter today after she was struck and killed by a Derby school bus. Joe Baker has been following this all day for us and just recently talked with the father of the girl. He joins us live in the area of that accident. And Joe, what's the child's dad saying? Mike, Rachel, the scene has been cleared for several hours now, but that doesn't take away the emotions felt after this morning's tragedy. We did have an opportunity to speak with the dad of the eight year old daughter. The girl who died is Harmony Harper. According to her father, the accident happened shortly after 715 this morning and about 30 minutes later, the eight year old girl was pronounced dead at the scene after life saving measures were performed. According to Captain Benjamin Blick with the Cedric County Sheriff's Office, the eight year old girl emerged from in between two vehicles before the bus hit and killed her. Blick says parents should be communicating the importance of road safety while walking to and from school or to the bus stop. Neighbors I've talked with today say they've had their concerns about children's safety walking in the Oaklawn area. Wife says she heard my son screaming for his sister and she came outside. I got woke up to I need you now, got dressed. Before I made it to the front door, I had heard call 911, my daughter's dead. I get outside and I saw the accident and it just, it hit me. Derby Schools is offering their support to students and staff. They're also helping the Harper family during this time. Here's a statement they released. We will provide information that we may receive regarding opportunities to help the family once it becomes available. Derby Public School staff are here and ready to help support our students, staff, and families cope with the loss. Joe, thank you. We've talked a lot about safety with the start of the semester. Uh, police believing it is an important time now to go over suggestions when something like this happens. So before you let them walk to school or the bus, uh, by themselves, do it with them so you can go over the safety rules for crossing the street. Make sure to look left, right, and then left again to check for cars. Always cross the street at crosswalks or intersections. And while waiting for the bus, stand six feet away from the curb. Lastly, if your child has to cross the street in front of a bus, teach them to walk on the side of the road until they're about 10 feet in front of the bus. Your child and the bus driver should always be able to see each other.